See, only you could depend on you because you're standing in your shoes. See, I made every wrong decision a young man can make. I lost everything I considered great. Sold drugs, went to jail, denied bail as my pants fell, but then the reality check came in the mail. See, I chased away anyone who's ever loved me. And lately, I can barely stand to look at the reflection I see. Hi, my name is King. I'm a hip-hop slash spoken word artist that's very involved in a lot of communities in the downtown Toronto area. Um, I'm with Pack Films Organization. I'm a student at the Remix Project, the Business 9.0 section. Um, I do some mentoring with some children at Central Tech with the Each One Teach One program, which is basically trying to inspire them to be better than they were yesterday. Well, the impact the arts has on my life is like, every day I try to wake up and create something new, which is which no one else is doing. So I try to find art in whatever, whether it's like up or down that I'm facing in my life. I either write poetry or write a song that not only myself but other people can relate to and maybe change their mindset of thinking or maybe inspire them to go out and pursue their dream because I feel like a lot of people have dreams but they don't really channel it to the right network so it could manifest into something greater than they were. So that's basically the importance of arts to me. It's like if I didn't have arts, to be honest, I don't know where I would be right now. You know, but whatever. See, the grass is greener on the other side where you could glide by the ties that history hides. So open your eyes and try to envision the essence of living life without a prescription. See, I'm not here trying to sound biblical. It's not healthy for your mind and your heart to work as individuals. So either your mind and your heart work as a team or collapse trying to chase this American dream. I, I strongly believe that organizations could help the young youth become successful, but it starts by financing them and actually putting money into their pockets for the hard work that they've done instead of just giving them some volunteer hours saying, oh yeah, this was great, thank you for coming out. Like, at the end of the day, like, People want to feel connected to society and feel like what they're doing is being accounted for and getting paid for what they believe in and love. And also, like, cross-national networking. Like, I think people need to explore what's out there, like, see what's out there to change not only what they do on a day-to-day -day basis, but actually change their mindset on how they look at things. I think we're so distant from nature that a lot of us really don't even care about anything no more. So for them to like go across to Canada may be one of the best things for them. So if there's opportunities like that, then yeah, I, I think the arts could even evolve into something greater than we ever seen before.